What's good y'all? It's Elik. So today I'm going to be showing y'all the fastest way to level up and the fastest way to progress your combat stats. Let's get straight into this video, man. All right, y'all, you're going to want to find the NPC Captain Tojo and talk to him. He's going to ask you if you want to go on an invasion. You want to press rank D or higher and go on the killing spree. Press invade and it'll take you to Wake of Mundo. So y'all, we are in Waco Mundo now, and we are going to fight a Storm Guard, and we want to pick him up. You're going to press V to pick him up after he is down. So guys, now that we have got him, we are going to pick him up by pressing V, and you want to follow exactly where I'm headed right now. So you're going to go through here, through this little cave. And you are going to go up a set of stairs and talk to an NPC, and he will hide you from all storm guards in the game. Guard up to him. Now talk to Tojin, press turn in guard, and he will say, ah, alright, just give me a second. Boom, disguise. As you can see, I now have a menace scar mask, and I could go up to any storm guard, and they will not attack me. This is literally broken, y'all. As y'all can clearly see, no matter what, the NPC will not attack me as long as I don't attack it first. This is literally broken. Now you can kill the other five storm guards without getting jumped because you get to choose which one you want to attack. And honestly, this helped out so much for my leveling progress. I literally got about 25 levels in an hour and a half, man. This is literally broken. Just showing y'all once again, they do not attack you when you have this mask on. It is pretty broken, but once you do attack them, they will start attacking back. But this prevents them from jumping you. At the spawn of Soul Society, and I'm going to show you how to get your combat stats and your support stats up really quickly. This is the fastest route that I have found so far in the game. You're gonna go over here to the city and kill all these rogue Shinigami. They will give you a thing that looks like a clamshell. It is a badge and you will return it to Tojo, the same person who takes you to the invasions. And you want to press combat stats and you can throw it into any stats. The more badges you have, the more of that stat you will obtain. This is the fastest thing I have found so far. I'm going to grip him right now, and I will obtain... Where the hell's my clamshell? Yes, guys, I am still using clone. I did not get rid of clone. I rolled my Ikai weapon. Let's try this again. We're going to grip him, and... What the hell is happening? A different server, and it actually showed me all the badges. This is what it'll look like here. How you know it is a rogue Shinigami, it will attack you before you even attack it. Now we will take these clamshells to Tojo and get our stats up. Alright y'all, now that we are speaking to Captain Tojo, we are going to press turn in badges. I would like to improve my stats. You can also get a yen payout, 45 yen per badge, but personally, I think improving my stats is a lot better for badges. It's up to y'all though. So we can see what I can upgrade right now. I am going mostly strength, so I am going to throw these badges into strength. As you can see, I got 66 strength. This is the fastest way to upgrade your combat stats and your support stats because they are not hard to kill. The next fastest way is to just fight Kisuke Udahara and Lagura. All right, y'all, we are now going to fight Kisuke. This is how you get a big bolster. I believe it is around 10. 10 stat points to whatever stat you choose. And all you have to do is beat him. It is not that hard. That we have killed Kisuke. You feel your Ryatsu has bolstered. That is what I chose. I went up. I actually may have went up 11 Ryatsu. I'm not sure. But this is... Not You can't do this all the time, and you have to pay him yen, which is the downside, but it is up to y'all. But this is the biggest amount that you can get, aside fighting Lagara. 
Alright y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap the video up here. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed my content. And if you'd like to see it more, turn on post notifications, man. Y'all have a good one. Peace.